humans, I'm Mr. King. Hello! Here, yeah, let's come to the examples of popular exam questions and answers for the periodic table chapter. So you see, first one, what is the relationship between the group number and the numbers of valence electrons? Remember, uh, the numbers of valence electrons it is the same as the group number, like example, group 1, 1 valence electron, group 2, 2 valence electrons, and so on. Okay, then describe how the types of oxide changes across the period. Okay, remember from left to right. Okay, it changes from basic to m 4 to acidic. Predict two physical properties of group 1 metals that are different from transition elements. Okay, remember, okay. Group 1, they have lower melting point, boiling point. Group 1, they are soft. And group 1, they have lower density compared to transition metals. Okay. Next, predict three chemical properties of transition elements. They are different from group 1. Okay, remember, all transition elements, okay, they have more than one oxidation state. They can form colored compound. And then that can be as catalyst. Okay? So next one. Okay, the observation when group 1 metal it is added to cold water. Okay, we know that they will produce metal hydroxide and hydrogen gas. But then what are the observations? Okay, see hydrogen gas is formed. Therefore, uh, fizzing okay, or uh, gas bubbles form. So-called effervescent. Remember, can okay, the reaction between group one and water it is uh, it is uh, very exothermy and dangerous. Okay, why? Because it is explosive. Okay, flame will be produced. Yeah, then what will happen to the group one metal? Okay, it will dissolve in the H two O. Okay, observation. Okay, next one. So why normal gas they are inert? Okay, because they have a full outer shell of electrons. Okay, that's it. Alright, thanks. Remember to like the video and subscribe to the channel. See you again. Bye.